Hi everyone, I'm Lizzie. I'm making a video today for Larissa because she didn't want to get more punishments and she can't make a video today. So I'm Larissa's friend Lizzie and we both go to school together. And I'm not going to edit this video going with the trend of having unedited vi videos. And I'm sorry to, I think it was Alex, sorry if I don't remember your name, right, who said that they were happy to see Larissa's face last week because you're not seeing her face this week. But I decided I did want to talk about something, so what I decided to talk about was how Larissa became not an antisocial bitch. When I first met her, it was, I was a cheer, I don't know if you guys know this, you probably do, but Larissa's a cheerleader, and although I don't approve of it, I was a cheerleader for a day, and that's how I met her. And so I was like trying to be nice and stuff, and she just kind of was quiet and antisocial. And so after that one day, that one awful day of cheerleading, um, I saw her again at we worked at the same day camp for a year. And so I went and I tried to talk to her and she, and like we have this thing called in service which is like preparing for it and getting, making sure all the counselors know all the rules and stuff of the camp. And I went to go and talk to her and we ha and like have lunch with her because I'd met her at cheer and stuff. And she was just like quiet and read her Harry Potter books a lot. And so me and my friend who also worked at the camp just kind of thought she was an antisocial bitch. And she kind of went on that way all summer where I would try and be nice to her and then she would just be antisocial bitch. But then the school year came along and she was new to see her, new to our school and, um, and on the first day we had like freshman retreat where the freshmen all go out in the woods and pretend like we're camping. And we were in the same group and we were in the same advisory so really that's, we just kind of started talking on freshman retreat when we were thrown into a cabin with each other and a girl who would wake us up in the morning by hitting us in the legs with her casts. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to tell the story of how Larissa became not an antisocial bitch and then just say, hi, I'm Lizzie and I'm subbing for Larissa. And I feel like I should talk about something else because I feel like this is going to be really short otherwise, so I'll try and talk for another like minute and a half. Um, the only thing I can think to talk about is boys, but I really don't want to talk about that because I don't really know you guys. But, hi, um, oh, so we do these things called pep rallies every year, and today we had ours for this year, and what it is is it's like every grade dresses up in a color, and then we and then we have like color class wars or whatever. Now last year we had this thing, we did tug of war. I don't, I'm, I'm pretty sure you guys have it in England. I don't know because I just know people from England, AKA my cousins, but I don't really talk to them because they're kind of jerks. But um, I, it's like you have this, I'm not gonna explain it, look it up if you don't know what it is. Um, they, so last year, in the thing that was like seniors versus juniors for tug of war, they pulled, they got this like really thin rope, and when they tried pulling on it, it snapped. And for one instance, for the only instance I've ever seen in the history of our school, our whole school was kind of united. I felt like for an instant when that rope snapped, our school was united. Well, today we tried to do tug of war because everyone actually kind of enjoyed it, and the rope didn't snap, and it was just kind of like, well, that was anti-climatic, -clim climax, I don't know what I'm saying, I'm sorry, I'm kind of sick too. Um, well, this has been nice talking to you guys about tug of war and how Larissa became not an antisocial bitch. And now she's like my best friend and we have another friend who's a bitch, so it all works out. Sorry for the language, I'm not good about that. If there was language, I don't know if bitch is like language to you guys, but... Nice meeting you guys. Subscribe to my channel, which I'll put in the little thingy-ma-bobber. And I hope to see you guys in the future.